Hey, this is Dave, and today I'm going to start my uh, SQL Server uh, tutorial, actually a SQL tutorial. Um, the only thing that this uh, requirement for watching this video is that you know what a database is and what a table is. The table we're going to use uh, for the examples is person.address. Uh, let me open that up so you can take a look at it. Basically, the fields it has is address ID, address line 1, line 2, city, state, province ID, postal code, spatial location, row GUID, and modified date. Let's start with the simplest query you could do on this table. All right, this query here is just going to display or retrieve everything from this table. Select star, which means everything from. AdventureWorks 2012 dot person dot address and just hit execute and it returns everything in that table you may not want everything returned in it you may only want like uh, let's say for uh, example you just want city and postal code so instead of the star you have city, comma, postal code. And it just displays those two columns. Another thing you may want to do, you may only want, let's say, the top five results. So for that, you'll use select top five and hit execute. And it just displays the top five Another thing you can do with this is use a where statement. So we'll say where city equals, say, Bathel. So this will just display uh, uh, the rows that have the city equal to Bathel. Actually, just the top five. Let's go to select star so we get... Uh, or just select city postal code so we get all of them. Okay, there's also, you can say where city equals Bathel and let's say postal code equals 98011. Let me put the apostrophes around it. So that actually returned the exact same results, but there's also an or you can use. So we can say where city equals Bathel or city equals Santa Monica. So we got all the rows with uh, Santa Monica or Bothell. Uh, with or statements, you may come across situations where you're going to have, like, let's say, uh, several uh, or statements. There's something you can do that's a shortened form. We can say we're city in and then just put a uh, parenthesis there. Bathel, Santa Monica, and this will do the exact same thing. So this is the end of uh, part one. There's probably going to be about 15 or 20 parts to this, so probably every day uh, I'll come out with a, a new episode, but thanks for watching.